Hi, I'm JJ Snyder for the Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're at Byron Allen's Fall Lineup Lunch Party. Hi. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Yes. And I deserve it, I'm telling you, because this is one of the most exciting things in 45 years of show business that I've been involved with. Wow, what yeah. is so exciting about it? Well, it's Byron Allen. It's a brilliant, brilliant show. I mean, you could say that 20 times, as I said to my friend just now. Byron Allen with 29 shows on TV, a, a creative moment, but also Marla Gibbs, Jack A., you know, Christopher D. Duncan, uh, you know, Kalita Smith. The cast members are pretty astounding. Okay, yeah. you know, yeah. Mr. Witherspoon. I mean, I, I, if I'd have gone to, you know, a, a palm reader, she would have said, and I would have probably fainted. Tell me about the moment when you found out you got the role. Well, we, um, actually, when was the moment I found out I got the role? My agent called me because I actually read for the father. And then I, my agent called me she, because Mr. Allen asked me to read for the butler, too, right? So my agent called me, she said, you got the part. And I said, okay, what part? And she said, the butler. And I went, yes, yes, because <laughs> that's exactly what I wanted. I really wanted the butler part. It's a brilliant part. It's so well written. And the relationship, and I was standing on the set, almost close to the final day of shooting with Christopher D. Duncan. And I looked at him, and I just, as we were rehearsing the scene, and I went, you know what? I could do this for the next 20 years. That's so groovy. Isn't it cool? Yeah. And I heard you say, you know, butlers, like, they really run the show. And, I, I mean, we've seen in, 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 there's been plays in theater 300 years back where the butler or the maid was the mischievous one and really the person in charge. Yeah, well, the, the butler goes back. Uh, this butler is mischievous, but he, he's not really mischievous as much as he is uh, more involved with things that he should be. Uh, speaks up with, against, uh, talks about dignitaries, uh, talks back to the president, uh, steals uh, chocolate chip cookies from the president with a great deal of enjoyment, <laughs> and the president puts up with it, right? So he's really kind of like part of the family, really just a, a, a real connected member of the, He really is part of the family. I guess that's the best way you could say it. Yeah, absolutely. It's going to be very exciting to see the show. Do you know the date of the premiere? I don't know anything. I know it's I mean, fall. Yeah, I, I don't know anything. I mean, I think if I did know, I'd probably go to Cedars right now for high blood pressure, okay? Oh. <laughs> it's going to be very exciting. Isn't it's it? very, very exciting. I, I think, well, one of the other things, too, is we're bringing a black family back on the TV uh, in, in, in the White House. That's very, very exciting. I mean, we, we haven't had this since Cosby. It's going to be huge, you know what I mean? And the other shows that he's developing, it's, it, the, the cast that he pulls together and the people that he pulls together, it's just like... I was just driving over today and I just thought this guy is really, really, really well connected. Wow. You know? Congratulations, go celebrate. Thank you. Thank you, folks. Thank you for your time.